what's up welcome back to my channel so today I'm gonna be doing my September monthly favorites um, so I have a couple of products that I wanted to share with you guys they're mostly like beauty related so let's go ahead and jump on in to the products start off with fragrances first because I just love my fragrances <laughs> my favorite is currently and has been for a long time like if this was the only Bath and Body Works fragrance I could have left for the rest of my life it would be this one and this is sweater weather and I just love this fragrance it has notes of sunkissed apple autumn leaves and orchard woods and it just smells so good it's like so fresh and fruity and I just love it. It's like my signature Bath & Body Works fragrance. So that is Sweater Weather. I just love it so much. And next I have the Brazilian Crush um, 68. This is the Jasmine and Pink Dragon Fruit. This smells like Cloud by Ariana. If you like that fragrance, then you will love this. My favorite part about this is that you can use it like in your hair as well. And so I get like whiffs of it because it stays in my hair for so long. I love any of the Sol de Janeiro scents and this one is no exception. It is so good. It smells just so sweet and yummy and I love it. My next one is actually from Juicy Couture and this is their Noir fragrance. This one is so yummy. It's like a really sweet dark berry fragrance mm. and I just love it especially like going into the fall time it's perfect for that so cute as well with this hot pink packaging and i actually scored this at i believe where did i get this was it a tj maxx or like marshall's once and it was the full size bottle whenever i see juicy couture anywhere for a discount i'm like snatch because i love their perfumes they smell so good i love viva la juicy like that's one of my favorite fragrances even though everyone knows that fragrance it will forever be one of my favorites so whenever i can find any of the juice couture perfumes for a deal you know i'm gonna snag them up right away let's talk about my favorite candle at the moment i've been burning the cinnamon spice vanilla i have a single wick of it actually on that vanity back there i've been burning as well um but this has paris cafe blended with it so it's both of them together and i love paris cafe that is one of my favorite candles and then mixed with the cinnamon spice vanilla is just literally perfection uh it smells so good it smells like you're just in a cafe and they're like cooking baked goods it smells so good i love this so if you guys haven't smelled the bath and body works um blends candles this one is my fave so perfect for fall let's talk about my current favorite bronzer and blush i just used these in a recent video and i've only been using them for maybe like a week or so but they're already like top tier on my list bronzer i have the medium shade and these do have really nice mirrors in them so there is that and then for the blush i have the volume two and then there is the blushes i have both of them on my face today and i've been using them for like the past week and i just think that they are so gorgeous they have great pigmentation and blend super seamlessly so if you guys are looking for some new face products these i highly recommend let's talk about lips um first off i have the nyx this is milky gloss and this is the ube milkshake flavor this is the ube milkshake gloss from nyx i've tried multiple of these and they are so good but specifically this one the ube one it smells literally out of this world i don't know what it is about this it smells so good you guys and here is the color it's like a really pretty purpley mauve and it just it matches anything it gives you such a beautiful color like a gorgeous gloss so comfy it smells so good like i cannot recommend these enough i love them the next one i want to share is by merit and it is one of their signature lightweight lipsticks and mine is in the shade baby just like they say they're super lightweight and comfortable and the shade baby just it goes with everything it's like the perfect nude pink almost and the packaging of these is like so luxe and pretty here is the swatch of the shade baby so pretty absolutely love it goes with everything it's like the perfect lipstick shade so i want to mention the la girl 
Ultimate Intense Stay Auto Liner in the shade Keep It Spicy. I use this in almost every single video that I film and I always am mentioning it so if you guys are subscribed and love makeup and haven't tried this yet you need to because it is like the best lip liner. Oh this is my old one. I need to throw this one out. Um, I have another one. This one I can't even get twist up anymore because it's completely gone but it's the perfect color I just love it um this one's my old one I can't even twist it up anymore so I think that's the last swatch I can even get out of it but so pretty favorite lip liner ever I have this mad for matte summer breeze palette from elf and I actually got this at tj maxx as well um and it's just so pretty I know it says summer breeze but these are such fall tones to me it's an all matte palette and you get like really pretty fall tones and I'm not kidding these blend like effortlessly they are so nice and so inexpensive so if you guys are looking for an all matte like fall palette this one is great especially for the price you cannot beat it so good and then I've also been using my TARDIS Pro to go which this don't look at this it's honestly beat to filth like it's so dirty and nasty but I've had this for years I've had this for years and I still love it to this day my sister's got it for me like look how used that is recently I've just been using it for like my work eyeshadow like it's like perfect a little everyday neutral moment so I've been using this constantly and I've noticed myself reaching more towards like smaller palettes than the big giant palettes because I feel like I get too overwhelmed and then I can't pick like what look I want to do and I can't decide what ones to use and I just get confused so like when it's narrowed down to like these smaller palettes I can come up with something quicker and easier and I don't have to like spend forever planning a look out. I don't know that's just been how I've been thinking about palettes and stuff recently so I've been drawn kind of more towards the smaller ones um but yeah these ones have been my go-to's for the month I've been using them so much the gold that's in this um Tarte palette called H in the shade hype is so beautiful like I love using this as like a highlight as well on my face when I use this palette. I did want to mention this elf no budge shadow stick and this one is in the shade copper chic. Um, I've had a love hate relationship with the no budge shadow sticks. Some of them I think are really good then some of them I just don't even like at all but I think this shade's really pretty. I've been using it a little bit recently to put it like under my eyes more of like a lower lash line thing and I think it's actually really pretty so I've been liking this for that I got it in my Ulta order as like a freebie one day but here is the copper shade it's really pretty for fall setting spray I've been using the stay all night micro fine setting mist a ton this has been like my go-to setting spray so I really like this and I love that the mister is so micro fine like it says it's just perfect so I really like this and then I also wanted to mention lastly my essence bronzer brush I actually have two of these I use one for bronzer and then I use one for blush as well and it's just the perfect size to either like do the apples of your cheeks or to even like blush up and it just I don't know it's so inexpensive and I think it's a really great brush and I don't hear many people talk about this one so I like this brush I'm going to share it with you guys don't mind that mine's dirty right now it's been definitely loved <laughs> so I think that is pretty much all of the beauty products that I wanted to come on and share with you guys today I hope you enjoyed don't forget to subscribe down below if you haven't already and give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed also let me know in the comments if you have any monthly favorites I always love discovering and finding new products thank you guys again so so much for watching and I will see you in my next one